Hello friends, this is teacher JB. Let us study English for three minutes. In this three minutes, we are going to study one word and one expression of English. And the word and the expression we are going to study today are are, be it, and bring up. Are, be it has three syllables. A, L, B, E, I, T, X on the second syllable. I'll be it. I'll be it. Albeit is a conjunction. It means in spite of the fact, regardless of the fact. In spite of the fact, regardless of the fact. And synonym is although. Although his trip was successful, albeit tiring. Although tiring, his trip was successful. His trip was successful, albeit tiring. I'll be difficult at times. Speaking another language is rewarding. I'll be difficult at times. Speaking another language is rewarding. I'll be it. I'll be it. And the expression is bring up. Bring up. It means start to talk about something. Start to talk about something. I hate to bring it up, but some of others said that. There is something strange about you. I had to bring it up, but some of the others said that there is something strange about you. I had to bring this up, but you have some food between your teeth. I had to bring this up, but you have some food between your teeth. When my mother is made at, uh, mad at me, she always brings up the time I forgot her birthday. When my mother is mad at me, she always brings up the time I forgot her birthday. So you read this part as brings and up. So read brings up, brings up. When my mom is mad at me, she always brings up the time I forgot her birthday. I really don't like the new coffee machine. You should bring it up at the next step meeting. I really don't like the new coffee machine. You should bring, bring it up at the uh, next step meeting. So the word is albeit, and uh, expression is bring it up. Albeit, bring it up. Albeit, bring it up. Okay, friends, uh, this is the conclusion of today's study. I will come back to you with another word and expression as soon as possible. Until then, keep studying English and have a great day. Bye.